Okay. Brandis, do you copy? Oh shit, I let me like go move over here. Yes, I'm inside the Ferguson's office. Okay, Brandis as himself. Okay, great job. Now, Proxima wants you to gather all the intel possible on Super Content LTD exclusive board. Look for a computer or data terminal and connect yourself to it. Okay. Hmm. Uh, what's the matter? This guy doesn't own a computer. Oh dear, what? <laughs> okay. Maybe this? Maybe this? What do you see? A device I've never encountered before. I'm sending you some images. Holy shit, that's a landline telephone. <laughs> I had some underground groups still use them because they're so obsolete. We hackers don't have the tools to hack them. Fair. You can tap them though. And they're right. Don't panic. I'll look for a manual online and tell you how to proceed. We still got this. Okay, I'll get comfortable then. <laughs> Neat. So yeah, this is Super Continent, L Super Continent LTD by D Deconstruct Team. It's a really cool looking game, that's why I picked it up. Yeah, am I using it right? According to the manual, yes, in your top hole is the earphone. And you're supposed to speak through the lower hole one. Dope. I, I, love, I love it when people, you know, uh, what you call again, uh, use old tech, retro tech in futuristic settings. <laughs> I mean, I mean, honestly, I personally really like retro tech. Like, you know, you know, the Cyberpunk 2020 days, those kind of tech, those things are like super cool. I, I, I don't know why, I really like those. Like, futuristic tech is just, hey, it's clean, it's, uh, sophisticated. Uh, Cyberpunk tech is the best, retro tech is amazing. So this is some sort of communication device. Exactly, you, you have to input an address using the numpad keys or number keys on your keyboard. When you enter nine digits, it'll automatically try to connect with that address. Cool, is that it? Yep. If you mistake a digit, you can reset the number by pressing backspace on your keyboard. So I'm gonna have to speak with some fellas. Luckily, I've, luckily I've bought with me my format, with which I can impersonate any voice I have if I have enough data. I bought Adrian Ferguson's voice installed on it. Okay, why do, you, why do you brought that? I mean, just in case there were some voice protect devices. I'm a, I'm a professional, like, I like to make my time worth your money. Proxima is very proud of you, Brandes. So what number do I call? I've checked the city's central phone system and there's nothing online. About super content and LTD landline addresses. What? More, ba more bad news? Tonight at 2am, our historical landline network will be disconnected permanently due to lack of use. Thank you very much to the last romantics who have been sending love and hope through this old system. Central phone system. That's in a few hours. Oh shit, okay. So this is a one-shot operation against the clock, huh? No problem. Okay, I'll take... Wait, did I forget to unmute my phone? I'm sorry about that. <laughs> Let me see. Okay. Okay, I'll take a look around and see what I can get. <laughs> Alright. Let's see. Uh... Mm, oh, phone book. It's a phone directory. The pixel art in this game looks so good. I really like it. But all the pages have been torn off. F. What about this? It looks like a note from Ferguson's secretary. It says your wife called. I hope you didn't forget the number again. 555-69-30-30. Hmm, it may come in handy. Okay, let's see. 555-39-69-69. Did I press the wrong number? F. Oh my god, I missed that sound. Ah, I missed that sound so much. <laughs> number you are calling isn't operative anymore and won't ever. F. B. Yeah, okay. Well, let's see. Wait, I want to see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. I want to try that. Or maybe 6, 9, 6, 9, 6, 9. I just, I'm just curious, you know. I, I'm just curious. Maybe. Maybe, let's see. Like, maybe if I put 696969, it'll be like nice or something. <laughs> Nothing? Okay, fine, fine, fine. Let's see, uh... What's the number again? 555-69-30-30. Oh, okay. Ah, whoopsies. No, 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 no. Yeah, I remember it. I remember it. Okay. 555-69... 30, 30. Okay. Ta -ta -ta -ta. 
Hello? Hmm, that's Adrian Ferguson's voice. That looks like this is... Oh, wait. <laughs> uh, that's not the wife. Never mind. Phone. Yeah. Phone bought that Ferguson's home. I use, I'll use format to simulate a random voice so I can call. Yes, him man, as many times as necessary. Okay, um... I'm calling for the, from the city's central phone system. Hello, Mr. Ferguson. How are you? I'm calling from the city's central phone system. Oh, yeah? What's the matter? As you know, service will be discontinued in a few hours. We're offering a fr free of charge service to retrieve all the obsolete equipment. Who, who do I have to speak to uh, with to get a directory of supercontinents installed landlines? Don't worry about it. We'll handle, uh, handle our own equipment. Thank you. Wait, but click. Ah, uh, okay, fine. Whatever, man. What about this? Let's see. Best chief financial officer, twenty-one oh one. Looks it's, looks heavy. This can really hurt someone if thrown at high speed. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, that was a weird thought. <laughs> yeah, it was. What's this? Calendar. A calendar from Supercontinent LTD. Supercontinent LTD Technical Office. For VIP clients. Okay, sure, yeah. Tech Office. 555 Oopsies. 555464032 Let's see. Mm. Come on. You've called the Supercontinent LTD's technical office. Please clearly pronounce your clan's security word. I love Supercontinent admin1234. I'm sorry, that key doesn't exist in the database. Have a good day. The technical office needs a password. Okay, fine. What password though? Um. Is there anything else I can like check here? Phone book has been ripped off. Can I call Vega? Do you need anything? Any ideas? Any ideas? Yeah, damn, Brandis. We're the one who's hired you. Oh, they're fine. Whatever. New past conversation you already tried. Okay, so let's try. Um, be a good salesman. If you need someone, I can look up online. You need anything? And that'll be all. Okay, back to work. Okay, what about me? Adrian, last name Ferguson. Oh, okay, like, um, their technical office needs password. Uh, let's see, tech office? Let's see, tech, let's try tech office again. 555 Uh, 555 Wait, no, 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 wrong, wrong number, wrong number. God damn it. God damn it. Damn it. Can I, uh, can I speed dial or something? I wanna like, I wanna speed dial. 555-46-40-32. Yeah, because I'm really bad at remembering phone numbers. Hmm... You've called the Supercontinent, yeah. I love Supercontinent. I'm sorry, the key doesn't exist. Okay, fine. Let's call. Let's call. Let's call Ferguson again. Let's call Ferguson again. What if I adopt idea? Like, what's it? What if I adopt like the idea of like you know Ferguson and then call the call the phone book. Uh, tech office. Tech office. Yeah. Five 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 four six forty thirty two. Come on. You've called Super Content LTD Technical Office. Yeah. Rip. I can't really do it. Uh. 555 Maybe you can call with his wife or something? Hello? Shit, that's. Uh. Wait, hang up. I can't. He's use his own voice. Yeah. It is my own voice. Uh, five, 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 six, nine, thirty, thirty. Uh. Okay. I'm really bad at remembering numbers. I'm struggling to remember the numbers. Hello. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Oh, updating client's password. Oopsies. Is that true? And I'm, who am I speaking with? This is Lucas Leipzig. Started as IT a couple weeks ago, sir. 
Nice, listen, Lucas, if you're truly working for us, consider you you fired. Yowch for trying to steal my password. <laughs> it's okay, sir. This was the test. We're checking if, if our company members have been well instructed. I guess you pass. Have a good night. F. F. Uh huh. Let's try again. Let's try again. I accidentally clicked that. That's why I was like, you know, I can skip that. Calling, come on. Hello? Hmm, yeah. Okay. Um. I'm calling for the super, from Supercontinent. Wait, no, that's like the same. Ah, uh, please stop insulting both our intelligence and go fuck yourself. Can I be like persistent? <laughs> I'm gonna wanna be persistent. Hold on. Uh, I, I don't wanna use his own voice against him. <laughs> Can I just keep on fishing or something? And like, you know, maybe uh, he'll just get tired someday. Hello? Yeah. <laughs> Super continent, yeah. Please stop insulting. Okay, fine. Uh, maybe like wrong number. Let's try. Let's try wrong number. Uh, five, 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 six, nine, thirty, thirty. I, I doubt this will be like you know. If this is real life, they will like know it's the same person. Honestly. <laughs> Hello. What if I like you know do the first choice, which is like wrong number. Oh, sorry, wrong number. Damn it. Hmm. What do you do then? Hmm. Technical office, VIP clients. I can dig this. No, for Ferguson secretary. Uh, is there anything else I can click? Let's see. Let's see. Um, I only get like these things. Uh, you know what? Let's let's try to let's try to let's try to become Adrian and then like try to call the tech and then like let's see if uh, I can get a different thing in magic. Five 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 four six four T thirty two. Five 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 four six four T thirty two. Calling. Let's see. Yeah. Client security work. There's no security word though. I don't have a. God damn it. Ah, uh, what do you do? Hmm, I'm confused. Hmm. Sorry if I'm this thick. Takes a while. Actually, what's that? Actually, like, is that a number? Hold on. Is that a number? Like, one three three seven. One three three seven. Let me write it down. Actually. Hmm. <laughs> do I have a paper? Hold on. Let me check. One three three seven, uh, nine nine. I think that's eight eight two two. Okay, let's see. Is it two? No, that's five. Yep, that's five five. Let's see. Let's let's try that. Um, it's like there's a thing image on the window. One three three seven, nine nine, eight five five. Will this call? I don't know. There's like a, there's a number in the graffiti. Is it operative, uh, operative anymore? Wait, is that I did it wrong? Hold on, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Uh, oh, I did it. Uh, I did it backwards. Never mind. I did it backwards. Hold on. Hold on. Let me try doing it like uh, five five eight nine nine seven three three one. Is it operative anymore? What number is that on the thing in magic? Is it nine? Yeah, that's nine. Uh. Um. Let me see. Two two. Is this also two? Maybe two two two. Oh wait! Oh wait! Oh wait! All the numbers start with five five five. I forgot about that. Five five five. So it's not five five eight. Five five five. Five five five. Nine, nine, seven, three, three, one. Let's try this because all the numbers start with five, five, five. I just realized that. I'm stupid. <laughs> well, well, what? Uh, I thought you were a different person. This time, this line is out of order. Goodbye. Wait, out of order? Click. God damn it. Unknown girl. What if I said say the two Ferguson? Let's see. Uh, five, 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 nine, nine, seven, three, three, one. 
555997331. Okay, let's see. You decided? Decided on what? Don't play fool or, or your wife is done for a Ferguson. Ferguson. Oh, his wife is kidnapped. Interesting. No, wait. Wait, damn it. Okay, what do you want? What do you want? I said terms are non negotiable. Postpone operation. CSG. J. If a single cop dies tonight, your wife will die too. Okay. Did, did you say postpone, not abort? Exactly, I'm all for supercontinent's cost, but CSJ can't happen tonight. Why? Dot dot dot. I have a family inside the police department. I want to make sure I can keep them safe before it all begins, but you won't listen. I'm sorry, but this is bigger than us. Why are you doing this? I swear to you, I'm loyal to supercontinent's cause. In fact, I'm plan planning on supporting the cause even if you're after my head. But simply, I cannot let CSJ happen tonight. It has to be postponed. Okay. Who are you? Come again? Are you in shock? You'll forgive me, but we executives have a hard time remembering. Uh, non executive people. <laughs> I'm Barbara, one of Supercontinent's enforcers. Okay. Barbara, who? Listen, I don't care for your incompetence. Do as I said or kiss your wife goodbye. Okay. Let's ask Vega about Barbara then. What if I can you find on Barbara? Yeah. Any other useful data? She's supposed to be an enforced supercontinent LTD. Okay, let me check. Take note, Barbara Lang, 26, enforced at supercontinent LTD, as you say. Uh, she's been working there for three years. Send that quickly up the ranks. The police department has an extensive file on her and... Wow. What? She's related to the chief of the homicide division. She's her daughter. And she's working for a criminal corporation, huh? In any case, look if you can find look if you can find some medical data on her, they'll they will be able to impersonate her with the foam mod. Okay, on it. Gotcha. Transmitting data. Need Barbara Lang added the foam mod. Yeah, I think that that's all. Yeah. Let's see if I can like let's see if I can impersonate impersonate Barbara and then uh call Ferguson's home. Okay, let's go. Uh, five, 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 six, nine, thirty, thirty. Hello? So you decided? <sighs> Barbara, you know we have been planning CSJ for years. We can't simply let this go. What does CSJ exactly consist of? Come on. We can't go over the deals all over again, Barbara. This is our best chance at bringing down the oppressive power the police have been putting on all of us through this true since the city's new Buralock. And the CSJ doesn't mean every policeman will die tonight. I trust on people's judgment. The most likely you will fall with the corrupted ones. Your father's got nothing to fear. Mm. Uh, I want a detailed profile on of the company's executives, yeah. Shit, Barbara, I can't agree to that, even with my with my wife's line life on the line. If I sell out the company like that, we'll, we we are all dead. Me, my wife, you, your dad. Okay, okay, I get it. Uh, tell me your password and I'll spare your wife then. My password, you say? Yes, the one for Supercontinent's technical office for VFP clients. But that's not an actual. I know, but if you don't save my father's life, at least give me a chance of doing of doing so. Your wife will get to live, and I'll. Make it look like you broke into your office and stole your password. Hmm, yeah, but... What? Your wife's life is not even worth a little shame on, on you for accidentally leaking a password? Alright, you win. The password is... Pangea. Okay. Pangea, huh? How romantic. What does that mean? I don't know. Your wife will be delivered safely to your home tomorrow morning. I also recommend you to unplug this line from the network. Why? I don't want you plotting with your colleagues. I'll be calling every now and then to check if your phone is online. If I hear a single tone, your wife is dead. Are we clear? Understood. Okay. Have a good night. Neat. So you can't really call him anymore. Okay. Let's see. Let's impersonate Adrian. And then tech office. 46, 40, 32. 5, 5, 5, 46, 40. No, 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 no. 555 five, five, 4640 32 
Okay, come on. You've called super continent, yeah. Uh, yep. Pangaya. What that? What if that means? Connecting with super continent's CTO office. Please wait. Da -da -da. Connected. Francis speaking. Who is this? Hey, Francis. Hmm. Can you give me our CEO's number? I need to make some consultations about tonight's operation. You know, Radhika doesn't own a landline. Don't be hasty, Adrian. Okay. She will call you after we detonate the bombs. Alright, okay. Bombs? Uh... How's CSJ coming along? On, on track, I guess. Why, are you nervous? I'd lie if I said no. Who came up with the name, by the way? The boss, probably, but hey, you can't... You can't... It... Isn't cool. Civil, simple, just this. <laughs> okay, but yeah, why? S but why simple? Shit, Adrian. I hope you're not trying to change it again. We're on the uh, verge of consummating the plan. Yeah, but still simple. Listen, it's simple because it puts the power back where it belongs on the people. The city's burlock was the straw that breaks the camel. The obnoxious current justice system is just a device to control us. The poor are just devoured by it, and the powerful not only aren't affected by it, it protects them. For fuck's sake, nowadays you can even pay to postpone the date of a trial. Sheesh. You know we've been trying to help the mid-low class with supercontinent's economic, economic muscle. But there's just too enough money to pay the way out of the system for everybody. That's why tonight we're going to break it. Civil unrest is at the verge of a riot outburst. We're just going to light the fuse so we can finally bring down the enforce of this unjust system. The police. Ah, I can't wait to witness the night trials tonight. People ex- <coughs> Oh, oopsies. <coughs> Executing sentences based on civil penalty. Manifesto we all defined for years on the deep web. Okay. Well, I'm all for it, but- I get to say it doesn't sound like a sound doesn't sound all that de democratic. Having almost 30 percent of the city population take part in it sounds representative enough for me. Okay. Yeah, you're right, Francis. Uh, when are the bombs going off? I believe Clyde is managing that. All right, sorry. Do you have this his number on hand? Don, you have it on your phone book? No, I'm very sorry. I destroyed it just to be sure, you know, being the last night for the landline. Oh, fuck. <laughs> yeah, I forgot how you went paranoid on the last meeting and tore all the pages from it. Pretty dramatic. Cut, cut it, Francis. <laughs> sorry, man. Clyde's number is 5556776623. Okay. 677623. Okay, got it. Uh, better get back to work. Okay. Okay, six seven seven six two three. Calling. Da, 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 da. Hey, hi Clyde. I'm Adrian. About the bombs. When are you going to detonate them? You tell me. We've been waiting for you to send us the codes for ages. What happened to your home line? Weren't you supposed to be there? It broke down. I came to the office as soon as I called when I found out. Okay, give me the codes. Oh shit, I'm very sorry. I've completely forgot about them. Are you fucking kidding me? We're in the middle of a, sh a shit storm, storm right here. I'm sorry, okay? I'm, I'm, I'm having a terrible, terrible night. But my wife has been kidnapped. Are you serious? Da -da -da. Man, I don't want to sound insensitive. Pay the ransom or... Whatever, but we need the fucking codes. Shit, Clyde. Are you... You are heartless. <laughs> okay, we are... Where are the codes supposed to be? I swear I'm gonna punch you in the face when this is over. <laughs> The codes are on your phone, say, flock in your office. Ooh, and how do I access it? Listen, Adrian, I can't have your, you losing your mind here. Not tonight. And put your fucking code in the very phone you're using to speak with me. And what was the code? I cannot fucking believe it, Adrian. How should I know? Fuck! <laughs> okay, okay, calm down. Ask, ask Francis and see. You're going to pay for this. <laughs> Call me in as soon as you get the fucking codes. <laughs> uh, God damn it. Whatever. <laughs> Let's see. Francis is the tech office, right? Uh, 46, 40, 32. Mm. 
Okay, let's see. Francis is in the team, check right? God damn it. <laughs> uh, Francis speaking, who's this? It's me. Hey, Francis. Um, I need to access my phone safe lock. But I forgot the <laughs> code. Shit, just didn't put the code on your phone. See, the thing is that I forgot the code. I need to get the detonation codes. Damn it, Adrian. What's wrong with you tonight? I'm sorry. The thing is that I don't have the code either. But I do have the security question. I made you rec rec record to retrieve it. Who's being extra cautious now, huh, Adrian? Alright, alright, Francis. You were right. <laughs> what was the question then? Here we go. The year of the first Rio Olympics, followed by my wife's date of birth. Oh dear. And when was your wife born? <laughs> Not my wife. Yours, Dime. <laughs> Yours, Dumbass. Uh, I was kidding. You got it then? Yes, thank you. <laughs> God damn it. When was my wife born? Sheesh. Let me try calling home again. I wonder. Uh, 69330. I wonder if it's still like active. I don't know. Is it not active anymore? I don't think so. Oh, sorry, this line's not connected to the network. Yeah, okay. Um, what? When is my wife born? Oh, wait, we can ask Vega, right? Yo, Vega. Yeah, anything? Can you find info on Clyde? Yeah. Super content LTD Clyde? I don't need to do a search for that. He's pretty famous. Oh, yeah, I don't have the, the pleasure. Clyde Dumbmaker, 45 Enforcer. He's some sort of. Of jack of all trades. Hitman, transporter, cleaner, and a demolitions expert. Dope. Sounds like a good friend to count with. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, but be careful with him. He's really short tempered. Gotcha. Fair. What about the format data? I'm sorry, Clyde is a ghost with the system. He doesn't have any medical records to hack. You'll have to do without impersonating him. Hmm, okay. Thank you. Do you need anything? That'll be all. Back to work. Okay. Clyde. Mmm, can't really impersonate him. F fine. Can I like, can I, can I talk with Barbara? Like, like Barbara, hold on. Uh, as Barbara on tech office. 555-46-40-32. Let's see. Uh, Francis speaking, who's this? Hello, Francis. Hey, Barbara, any news on those sent? Toro assholes? He doesn't know about Barbara kidnapping Alien's wife? I better keep that away until I need to kick the Hortons' nest. Centauro? Well, I gotta admit, they're giving me a hard time. Don't give up. If you manage to plant the neural neural disruptor I gave you, close to 100 meter of their hideout, hideout will own them. But that's the half to be tonight. What about CSJ? Other forces is dealing with that. You focus on those hackers. They'll endanger the CSJ if we let them. And what about Proxima? Hey, what are you doing? Wait, what? I'm doing your favor, trust me. Those Proxima losers have too many ties with the police. They will be busy after the bombs go off. Yeah, about those bombs. <laughs> Listen, Barbara, with all due respect, go back to work. <laughs> but don't call me until you've finished your assignment. Fine, what about... Let's see, uh... What about... Um, uh, Clyde then? 677-623. 677. It does not 7. 677623. Okay. Let's see. Uh. Yo, Clyde. Where's Clyde? Come on, calling. Hey! How's CSJ doing? Fucking wrong. Brian was killed. It can't be. How? Listen, I'm expecting important calls. Focus on your mission. Goodbye. Damn it. Who's Brian? Yeah, who's. Wait, no? Okay, fine. No, Brian? Fine. Who the hell is Brian then? Uh, what if I like be like uh, nobody and try to call Clyde? Uh, five four five six six seven six three. Okay. Okay. Let's be myself and then like talk to Clyde. That sounds like dating advice. <laughs> hey, good night, sir. I'm calling from. I don't know who you. Ah, damn it. Okay, fine. Uh, what about uh tech office then? Four six forty thirty two. Four six. Wait. Five 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 four six forty thirty two. I think there's a number. I kind of forgot. Hmm. Come on. Francis speaking. Who's this? Good night. I. Uh. Calling from the city central phone system. 
Good night. How may I help you? Good night, sir. As you know, all services will be discontinued, discontinued tonight. That's right, I'm aware. Are you the owner of this line? Affirmative. Can I call you to confirm that you're aware of the 900,000 credits fine applied to landline owners who haven't properly cancelled their accounts. What? And you're telling me this now, you bloodsuckers? <laughs> Piece of shit, you already charged us enough for this obsolete communication system. Calm down, sir. I'm calling you to check if you are willing to fill a voice form to properly cancel the line and, of course, avoid the fine. You bet. What do we need to do? It's easy. Just answer a few questions to fill the form with your personal data and that's that'll be all. For God's sake. All right, go ahead. <laughs> yeah, you got, getting Francis' voice. Full name? Francis uh, Coconut. Age? 30 years old. I found him. I'm updating the database. Nice. Com company? Super Continent LTD. Full name of the CEO of the company? R Wait, why do you need all this data? I may have pushed it too much. Shit. Time to bail. Don't worry, sir. I'll look it up. Thanks for your cooperation. Wait. Click. <laughs> Can does Vega know anything now? Like no, okay, fine. Let's see. We get the voice of uh, Fr Francis now. I thought I heard. Yeah, it's Radika. Yeah. Pastor Rio Olympics plus wife's 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 date of birth, phone safe lock, night trials, penalty manifesto. Okay, let's let's be Francis and then like let's like let's start calling people. Uh, the tech company, I think. I can't really call the tech office because that's Francis, so Clyde. Uh, I think this. I think it's 232. I can't remember the number. Damn it, I forgot. Is this the right number? I don't know. Rip. Damn it, I forgot. I forgot uh, what the number is. Um, oh, it's 623. Okay. 555677623. Okay. Hey. Good night, sir. I'm calling from. Wait. Oh shit. I uh. For, I need to like. I forgot to. Oh wait. Inf insufficient data to inf impersonate. Never mind. Can I like get Vega to like? Uh. Any ideas? Oh damn it. Like I thought I could lie. I thought I got uh. Francis Steam Magic. Yeah. Come on. I thought you got Intel on Francis. No. Okay. Fine. Back to work. Uh. Insufficient data to impersonate. I already did Adrian and Barbara, so... Uh, can I to talk to Barbara again? As like, uh, yeah, Barbara as, a uh, uh, as myself, so... Uh, 555 Wait. 555-997-339. I think it's the number. I can't really remember. No? Okay, I think uh, I sh the dial is kinda hard. Uh. 331, okay. 997331. So. 997331. Okay. Let's see, come on. Well? Well, what? Oh, I thought you were a different person. Goodbye. F. Okay, if Adrian then? Uh yeah. 555 Okay. Okay, come on. Yeah, maybe we can ask for more info. Get, give me good news. I almost have it sorted out. Francis and the rest are almost convinced. But before proceeding any further, I want to make sure this isn't all worthy. Is my wife okay? As long as you meet your end of the deal, yes. I need to be sure, can I ask her something? Why is it? I want her to tell me her birth date, she'll know. Her birth date? Please, this is important. Ah, Christ, okay, give me a sec. 2nd of November, 2075. Alright, thanks. What about the other date, like... Rio Olympics, what's Rio Olympics? Is this Rio Olympics? No, it's not. What the hell is Rio Olympics? Can I... let's see. No, okay, fine. Rio Olympics plus wife that date of birth. Um one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 
eight, nine. What the hell is the Rio Olympics? Can I should I search it up on the internet? I'm search it up. What the hell is Rio Olympics? I don't know what Rio Olympics is. Rio Olympics. What the hell is Rio Olympics? 2016? Like 2016? How many numbers is that? Uh, so it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Wait. Oh, it's plus. And it's 9 numbers. What the what's the thingy then? What's the What the hell is Rio Olympics? And I'll be f uh, Ferguson and then Adrian Ferguson and then like try to call the office again. Five four five four six forty three two. Hmm. Calling ring ring. Francis speaking. Who's this? Hey Francis. Ah oh, okay. Uh. Are the, oh, the bombs going off? Leaf Clyde is managing that. No, get damn it! I already read this. Damn it! Uh, I already read this. Uh, can I talk to Clyde then? Yeah, what are we, Clyde? Uh, six, seven, seven, six, two, three. Come on, Clyde. Ring ring. Hey. Hey Clyde, I'm Adrian. I heard Brian died. I heard Brian died, yeah. That's that. Not... Are you okay? Listen, fucking Detective Yo Listen, fucking Detective Yoshida is hunting us down. Detective Yoshida? Yeah, the head of city police's homicide division. Man's a fucking psycho. He's gonna vigilant and is tracking us down with optical camo and laser guns. Oh dear. And yeah, he's gunned down Brian. Brian, the unfortunate leap, leap of fate there. Yeah, Brian the fucking enforcer, Zack. Listen, I want to uh, do us all a favor. Seeing this night is getting more dangerous than we expected, give me your data and Brian's data so I can try to pull off a bureaucracy trick and get you a life insurance for your families and the company. You're serious? Cool down and acknowledge this. This is for the best in case something happens. This will also con for injury if you... If you don't die, you may reap some juicy benefits. Think of Brian's family too. Full names, age, and medical DBID. Alright, Clyde Dumbmaker. 45 but I don't have a DBID. Okay, I'll sort up the medical DBID thing. Alright. And Brian is uh, 25, don't know his med DBID. Okay, I'll see what I can do. I'll get back to you as soon as I get an update on the mission. You better, Adrian. About the bombs? I still need to find the codes. Click. Damn it. <laughs> uh, you need anything? Uh, can you find- what can you find on Clyde? Zero content LTD Clyde? I don't need to search- um... Keep some sort of- yeah, okay, I already got that. Yeah, but careful with him, he's short tempered. Yeah, I already know that. Yeah, I don't have a uh, DBID as well. Hmm, okay. Yeah, I think, yeah, that's all. Okay, fine. Yeah, I think that's a bug or something. Brian is dead. And then, what else? Um, can't really impersonate Clyde yet. Adrian's wife, D.O.B., is, uh... In, what is this? Um... Can I not, like, get more, uh... Info here? Wait, can I... Can I adopt Barbara and then call Clyde? 677623. Uh, Barbara calling Clyde. I think I already done that actually. I kind of forgot. Hey, how's CSJ doing? This I'm expecting important calls. Focus on your mission. Damn it. What's the code for the save? I'm not sure what Rio Olympics is. Like. Rio, oh, maybe like I need to, uh, uh, what you may call again, get the, get the dates, uh, like plus the dates, I don't know, but doesn't make sense though. 
I'd like it's nine numbers, right? Hold on, hold on. It's just nine numbers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's just nine numbers, and then the date of birth is. Is it plus in the sense of like put it on in front of it or what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I I'm missing two numbers. Maybe it's like you know. Maybe it's um. I mean, the only thing, the only Rio Olympics I know is like the 2016 one. I just searched it up. Uh, so 16 maybe. 16 two two one one. I mean 16 two one one 2075. Okay, let's see, let's see. Huh? 16 two one one. Uh. 2075. No, okay, fine. How do I get the number then? Um. Okay, I kind of needed to look at the guide, so it's a bit, it's a bit, uh, it's a bit complicated. It's 216, 211, and then 75. So it's because it's like, because the month, oh, it's like, I know, it's, it's really confusing. Like, that's, the format is confusing, but yeah, there's the save. Sheesh. Goddamn. I took a bit. Okay, so what's this? Hmm. 0005550080. Detonation code. So I can set up a bomb calling to this number, huh? Okay. Interesting. So do, should I just call the number or what? Can I talk to Clyde? 555-677-623. 555-677-623. Let's see, let's see. Hmm. Hey. Hey, Clyde, I'm an alien. I bought the bombs. I still didn't find the codes. Uh, okay, okay, fine. I guess, like, the only... I think that's the only option is to dial the bomb code. Let's see. Uh, bomb code. 0005458080. Okay, let's dial the bomb code and see what happens. Wait, should I call Fega first? Satellite Pulse Bomb Launcher activate. Insert coordinates for deployment. Shit, this is some serious technology we're calling. <laughs> oh god, is that a fun? I know. World, World War 3 band stuff here. I'm afraid this is the end of the line, Randy's. Excuse me? I'm sorry, beauty. You truly are a professional, but Proxima only. Ah, uh, is Vega like the troop mastermind here? How do you to get access code to this little toy? Yeah, freelancer's life it really sucks, huh? <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. You know this business, no hard feelings. It's all yours, Detective Yoshida. Ah, okay, neat. Keep, it, keep him in check while I download all the useful data from his brain drive with my Neural Disruptor. Fuck me, I, if I don't hate Neural Disruptors, they're just so unethical. Rip. Could this is cool though. Can I call Fega again? Hello? Can I call something? No? Okay, fine. Oh, ooh, Yoshida? I'm sorry, Vega. Uh, you know how a uh, freelancer's work life works. Click. Call Centauri. Wait, I should have like should have used the thingy magic. Uh, connection sta stabilized. Good night. As request, I discovered he was the Proxima Mole inside the city. Please, you know what they wire the funds. As for the super content, LTD, orbital bomber, that will cost you an extra. Oh, okay. Thanks. For ah, I thought I used need to like use the thingy magic, but hey, neat. So this this is Super Content LTD by Deconstructing Team. Uh, so it I really like the puzzles though. I think I'm just a bit stupid when, on some of the puzzles, but a really nice game. Sheesh, I need a lot of editing because I need I need to look at the guide a, a few times. But yeah. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, this is it for the game. I don't think there's anything else, so I'm just gonna go here because I'm getting tired. It's actually midnight right now. I'm gonna go sleep. Have a nice day, everyone. <laughs> Oopsies. Bye bye, have a nice day. Uh, leave a like if you like this video and leave a sub if you want to see more indie game content like this. I do indie game stuff. Or if you want to like see more, you can feel free, feel free to request games as well. I'm going now, bye bye, have a nice day. Boop.